15 case, all that for a bit of food that Neil's got. Um, and uh, he tries his very best not to duck, because we feel it doesn't inspire confidence in the audience if he's ducking everywhere. But, as you can clearly see, you just can't help it. <laughs> and you can't, because you've got all these birds right at you. And um, they're all after a bit of food. This is kind of what they're like in the wild. They'll cut into a swarm of insects, catch and eat, catch and eat. And so it's really energy efficient. Rather than having to land every time and then expelling more energy to get back into the air, they'd rather just do everything whilst airborne, which is uh, just a great way to do it. Um, OK, where's little big on? I haven't seen him again since. Might have flown off somewhere. Oh, there's little big on. Can you see the leather straps there just hanging over, coming round now, really low level, looking a little bit wobbly. That's him. Here we go. Coming over the audience now. Front row, low level. We've got to make sure we look after little big one. Here he comes now. Go. Oh, no, he's just gone past. Oh, loads of food. Look at that. And he still didn't get any. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> Excellent. Now, these birds do have an association with the military as well. Uh, we've heard loads of stories over the years from, from soldiers that used to play tricks on new recruits. Um, apparently, it was really funny to send a new recruit from the mess tent out into the parade area, um, but not tell them about the, well, 20 or 30, in some cases, kites that would try and steal their only meal for the day, basically. But apparently, it was a bit of a sort of initiation. Um, so we're going to see if we can try and ruin out this for you now, in true military style. Neil, he's going to wander across the arena with his billy tin and his only bit of food. Oh, and this is exactly what used to happen. <laughs> Fantastic. And again, oh, there's little big on. It's the only bit he's any good at, so keep your eyes on him. Here he comes, round again. Little big on. Go for it. Oh, he got it. I thought he was going to land on the tinder. And another kite. Yes. Fantastic. And only a couple of birds join in in this, but it's quite weird, really, how some of them just ignore you completely. And there's certain birds that sort of have their roles within the team, which they kind of just pick themselves. Here's little big on. Look. Waiting for a bit of food. Oh, he missed it. Go round again. Yes, got it. Ooh, he's having trouble eating, though. <laughs> See what I mean? Look, in the short space you've seen him, you can just see why he's different to the other birds. He's a bit of a liability, really, but... And another one. I've got one more for Little Big On. He's coming around again. Watch out! <laughs> why do we fly that okay. kite? <laughs> okay, he's coming around again. We'll see if he joins in. Um, now, here comes Little Big On. Look, final bit. Oh, no, he's landed in the audience. We've spoke about this, Little Big On. Just keep your eyes on him. Uh, now, folks, what we're going to really do is try and utilise these birds that are out around the beech trees nice and high uh, because we're going to see if we can try and introduce some high acrobatics. Um, Neil has got a catapult and he's going to now propel food to incredible heights. Uh, we've got another buzzard coming over, European buzzard, nice and high look, that's not our bird. If Neil can get that one to catch, I'll be really impressed. <laughs> okay, so keep your eyes on these high birds. Here we go, and a real high shot. Yes. And they can catch and feed all at the same time. Little Big On done join in this bit, so he just hassles Neil until he throws him a bit of food up. Uh, that's normally the way that he works. <laughs> I've never seen him fly as high as those birds. I think he threw him a nosebleed, so... Here we go, straight up again. Ooh, bit of a twist and a turn. Dropped it. Again, incredibly acrobatic. They can just stand on their tails in order to catch the food. And um, they've got a real low wing load in these kites now, so although they look quite large birds, they're incredibly light. Uh, they weigh under two pounds, these birds do a piece, so um, they're absolutely tiny. So massive wing, massive tail, uh, which gives them good soaring ability, and they can surf on the breeze, and they can stoop and dive and twist and turn. They're just great all-rounders, really, which is why they're incredibly successful. Oh, misfire. The uh, kite did get it. And another one, dropped a bit of food. A little big one still hanging around. And now whilst we encourage you to look up at this point, um, please do with your mouths closed because it is raw chicken that's been fired in the air. And uh, Neil has got a habit of firing the food right over the audience on occasions, uh, which can be a little bit interesting, to say the least. OK, another high catch. And again, straight up. Ooh, bit of a twist. Just missed it. Fantastic. Now, what we're going to try and show you now is the grand finale of the kite part of the demonstration. Um, Neil is going to now attempt to fire up two bits of food at the same time and hopefully get them both caught by his team of kites. It's the only time that he calls the birds, because he needs at least four or five over his head for this to have the desired effect. So, he's got birds, he just needs to draw them in now. He's, they're calling over, they're coming in. Here we go, he's got four, five, six birds, two bits of food, and here we go! Yes. Best, yeah. Now, normally when we do our grand finale, you get a massive spontaneous round of applause from the audience. But it fell, no, it's too late now. The moment's gone. <laughs> 
And I need to let you into a secret. The signal for the kites to go home is to hear a massive round of applause from the audience. If we don't get that, we're stuck with all these kites flying around. So we're going to do it again. This time, Neil is going to fire up, well, you tell me, five? Five bits of food, which is, I don't think I've ever seen it done. Five bits of food, if it works, big round of applause, kites go home. If it doesn't work, can we still have an equally loud sympathy round of applause? Whatever happens, clap. Okay, he's got birds everywhere. He has got a chance. He's got the whole team coming over. He's got five bits of food. Crazy myself, but here we go, here we go, one, two, three, four, five, yes! 